I'm Dr. Kelly Sawyer, The Ready State. One of the aspects of the H-Wave that I love is that once people have moved out of their acute injury or sort of acute trauma or acute surgical, post-surgical phase, we have this incredible device that we can actually utilize when we overdo it or when we enhance our recovery. So remember that the H-Wave has two settings, high frequency and low frequency. The bulk of what we prescribe for most of our athletes or people post-surgery or in pain is low frequency, which creates a non-fatiguing muscle contraction that allows me to get movement in a system that the brain perceives as safe, but also allows me to decongest the system so I can move the lymphatics out. But we also know that we start to see muscle-activated sort of recovery cascade effects happening, which is short for increased blood flow to these areas. So if I've engaged in some kind of rigorous activity and I want to be able to do that the next day, it turns out that the same technology that I was using after my surgery or after my acute flare-up or chronic pain can be used to actually enhance my recovery. So this technology we can use with our elite athletes, even if you don't self-identify as one, if you feel overworked or you went for a big hike and your quads are feeling overdone or you had to do a lot with your low back, we can get you pumping and this, that non-fatiguing muscle contraction on a low frequency setting done for as little as 20 minutes but can be done for an hour or broken up whenever it fits into your life can go a long way towards reducing something as simple as DOMS, delayed onset muscle soreness. So while I might not fancy myself as a professional athlete driven by wattage for uh, success in my life, being less sore after big activity for me is an absolute win. So remember, the same technology that we use in a sort of our medical setting can be also applied to my day-to-day -day life. How do I get more work done and how do I enhance my body's ability to recovery, recover from strenuous activity?